Hello, my um, Dawn Chorus kit um, has arrived from the Shapiers Pick and Mix Cake Al Experience. Um, it's the second in the Dawn Chorus kits. Um, there's three, all on a bird theme, songbird theme. So this is the second one, which is the blue tip cushions, which are designed by me. Um, you can choose whether to knit or crochet with everything that's inside the kit. Um, so this one here is the knitted cushion, which um, is knitted with scrumptious and there's a duplicate stitch design on the front. Um, the crocheted cushion um, has got a cross stitch design on the front, so the slight differences in between them. Um, the crochet one is a bit more graphic, the knitted one is a bit more realistic, um, but I'll be doing some blog posts just comparing the two before we start the CCAL. Um, so the box is absolutely gorgeous. There's like a really cute little um, birdie footprint on it. And look at those, really cute. Um, it measures, if you were thinking of getting one for a friend or something or getting one delivered. This is my old um, school ruler. So yeah, about 25 by 21-ish by about 13, something like that. And then uh, on the back, we've got what is in the kit. So there'll be three balls of scrumptious, 100 gram balls. Um, scrumptious is made out of recycled plastic bottles. Um, so if you've ever felt scrumptious before, you would not believe there is like plastic in it at all. It feels like any other acrylic. It's really, really soft. It does not feel plasticky. Um, there's Shapier's Callista. So there's 11 little balls of that, which are, there's 11 different colours in the um, embroidery on the front. So when we use the Callista, one thing to note is we're not going to be sewing the ends in. If you've ever done like cross stitch or duplicate stitch before, you might have ends to sew in, but we're going to use the properties of Callista um, with a special knotting technique, which we'll be showing in the tips and tricks. Um, and when you come and in the pattern, so don't worry about sewing ends in. It's not going to be an issue at all. Um, tapestry needle. I was quite fussy about the tapestry needle that went into this kit because I wanted it to be a really good quality. I am a bit fussy about having good quality tools. A uh, set of three postcards in there. There's some free extras. Um, a sticker sheet. Ooh, a wooden yarn organiser. And a tissue de Marie fat quarter pack. I've used quite a few of those in my um, designs for Shapey's little, pretty little things. Um, there's not the cushion insert inside the pack, obviously, because it wouldn't fit into this little box, but they're quite readily available. Or you might have a cushion 45 by 45 that you just want to recover um, and not pay for a new one. Yeah, so there's the um, designs of the others on the back. There's Martin Up North Gold Crest Scarf, which was the first um, project in the Dawn Chorus CCAL. That has been amazing. There's been some absolutely gorgeous scarves on the Facebook groups. Well worth a look at if you're not on the groups already. Um, and yeah, Blue Tick Cushion, Kit 2. So we're starting that in April. And Kit 3 will be available later in the year. So let's open it up. I do like it, Kit. Oh, I don't want to rip this now. Can I do it without this thing? Oh, I have to go for it. Not the camera there. Um, oh, that's really cute. So this has got all the holes in, so you can put your Callista colours in and put a little number there or a letter, so it's easy to recognise which colour you're going to be using. That's going to save a bit of time. It's really sweet. Ah, I've got a blue tip on the postcards as well, and then. Yeah, there's a little note from me on the back of the postcard. 
found some codes to scan as well. Oh, scan the QR code for a surprise. I don't, I haven't got a clue what that's going to be, so that's exciting. So these postcards um, with all three kits, they're going to join up to make up a picture, like a bit of a jigsaw. Yeah. Obviously, need all three, all um, or nine postcards to do that. Ooh. Need a little cutout. You could put them on like a lolly stick or something. They'd be cute in your plants. Needle, nice quality needle. Yeah, as I mentioned, really fussy about needles. So I wanted this to have a really smooth hole and be a really smooth needle, which is quite important when you're going through because you don't want to catch any of the yarn. Uh, what's this? Oh, yeah, that's just the information about all the, the three kits that are coming. We've got a sticker sheet. You're, oh, cat's come to visit. Oh, these are really sweet. I do have a few stickers on my laptop. I've not got over that since I was a teenager. A packet of fabric as well as a free gift. So you could use that for all sorts of things. Um, yeah, as I said, I've made quite a few projects for Shapey's little, pretty little things with these. Um, yeah, I think we're going to put some ideas on um, Pinterest as well with um, things that you can make with these. Oh, and the yarn. Yeah, the main event. So these are the 11 colours, blue titty colours. It's a bit of a dark day today so they are a little bit more vibrant than they're showing on the camera. And then there's the three balls of scrumptious. So it's quite surprising um, how much yarn you use with knitting compared to um, crochet. That was one of the biggest challenges of designing these cushions is to use exactly the same materials for both knitting and crochet because crochet uses up so much more yarn but actually in the end it worked out really really well because um, we're going to be knitting double stranded if you're knitting you can use two strands of scrumptious um, because it just gives that firmer fabric to stitch into and um, you'll probably use two and a half balls maybe something like that if you're knitting maybe slightly less um, which give you some, gives you some options if you wanted to make a flap or something like that when you cushion um, if you're crocheting you'll probably use two and three quarter balls something like that um, and the amount of calista used for both is quite similar there's plenty in there so don't worry that if you make mistakes or anything like that or you need to pull anything out that there's not going to be enough we've made sure that there's with plenty in the kits for you. So that is that. I'm really looking forward to um, starting that and um, seeing a, a whole flock of blue tick cushions appearing this spring. Bye for now.